morning kids. How's your summer vacation going? I know that Ermin, Trude, and Stripesy and I have been outside a lot. We've been playing games. We've been down to the beach. But Stripesy and Ermin, Trude were both complaining because they're already getting bored with summer vacation. It wasn't what they expected it would be. They've been looking forward to it so much with all those Zoom things. And it was just a little bit different. And things aren't always going the way they want to. But I said, well, every time we have something that goes wrong or a little different than we want, we always have to learn. And Stripesy said, why does everything always happen to me? And Ermintrude says, to you, it's always happening to me, too. The two of them are going to see who the worst things happen to. And I said, okay, it's about time I bring out one of my favorite books. It's called It Could Have Been Worse. It Could Have Been Worse by A.H. Benjamin, pictures by Tim Warns. Mouse was on his way back after visiting his town cousin when... Uh-oh. Look out. Whoops! He lost his balance and fell to the ground. Ouch, said Mouse. This isn't my lucky day. But it could have been worse. Mouse picked himself up and continued on his way. He came to an open field and was scurrying across it when... He fell into a dark hole. Why do things always go wrong for me, grumbled Mouse. But it could have been worse. Mouse climbed out of the hole and was off again. But soon he got sleepy. I think I'll take a rest, Mouse said. He had just found a comfortable spot when... Ouch! He sat on a thistle and shot into the air. Everything bad happens to me, wailed Mouse as he pulled the thorns out of his fur. But it could have been worse. Mouse trotted down the street until he reached a stream. He began to cross it using the stepping stones when... Splash! He slipped and fell. I'll catch a cold, complained Mouse, but it could have been worse. Mouse paddled to the edge of the stream and climbed out of the water. Shaking himself dry, he was just about to scramble down a steep bank when... Whee! He lost his footing and skidded to the bottom. I'll be black and blue all over, cried Mouse. But it could have been worse. Mouse staggered to his feet and ran the rest of the way home. It's been a terrible day, he said to his mother as she bathed his cuts and bruises. I fell into a hole, got wet in the river, and... Never mind, son, she said. Snap! It could have been much worse. Well, what'd you think? That was pretty lucky for Mouse, or he was pretty blessed. All of those things that could have gone wrong, he could have been eaten by a fox or a fish or a hawk, all those would have been terrible things, and he thought he was just unlucky when he fell into a hole or something. See, sometimes we don't know how God is walking with us. When we think it might be something really bad, God is saving us from something worse or helping us as we grow. So, what do you think? Are you still disappointed? Hmm. Are you? Sometimes, yeah. We can still be disappointed, but we know that God is always with us and getting us in the best way that we can. So, we're going to have a good week this week. It might be a little boring sometimes, and that's okay. 
and we'll have some good times sometimes. But wherever we are and whatever we do, God is with us. Let's pray together. Dear God, thank you for our friends that we can play with sometimes, and sometimes we're missing some of our friends. And sometimes, God, we're just alone or we're just bored. But we thank you that you're with us all the time, no matter where we go and what happens to us. Help us to remember that. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. All right. So, kids, what are we going to do this week? What's something fun? Hmm. A stuffed animal pet show. What do you think? Think that will be good? I think that would be great fun. Hmm, the furriest, the fattest, the skinniest, the the loudest. Can, can stuffed animals be loud? I think maybe they can. Will you have a good time this week, kids? Goodbye.